Well, the countdown to kickoff is on Texas Tech to host UT at a sold out Jones AT&T Stadium tomorrow at 2.30. There is going to be at least 60,000 fans there, so here are a few things to keep in mind. First of all, you know that there is no greater fan in the country than a Red Raider fan, right? And this game will be supercharged, so there will be an increased law enforcement presence there. Ticket booths open at 1130 tomorrow morning, but tickets are now all mobile. So Texas encourage you to download your ticket before you get to the stadium. Cell phone service also may be spotty with so many fans all in one place. Get there as early as possible. Premium gates open two hours before kickoff and general gates open 90 minutes before kickoff. Tech also now has a clear bag policy. You don't want to get turned away from the game because you don't have one. And with that sold out game, fans all around will be looking for the best parking spot closest to the stadium. But beware if you park in the wrong space, your car won't be there after the game. A lot of times fans try to park in front of restaurants like Fuzzy's on Broadway, which really disrupts the flow of business and takes away spots from paying customers. So Fuzzy's is left with no choice but to tow those cars. And it's the same for a lot of businesses near the Jones too. A lot of folks park head to the game or do whatever and it's just makes us look like we're real full and we're we're not so it just it it does hurt our business. I even make my employees park on the street so you know the the guest doesn't have to you know park down the road and come over here. You don't want to not have a car after the game, right? <laughs> now, you can park for free at the parking lot by the National Ranching Heritage Center and also on the corner of 4th Street and Texas Tech Parkway. City Bus is providing rides to and from the game from these parking areas for five bucks.